Hey, happy hump day, Twin Tears. I'm Chelsea Lavelle. Here's what you need to know today. The House is set to vote today to impeach President Trump for the second time. The single article of impeachment charges Trump with incitement of insurrection following last week's Capitol breach. With the House's Democrat, Democratic majority and the votes of at least five Republican members who have said they will join the impeachment effort, the measure is certain to pass. That will make Trump the first U.S. president to be impeached twice, just like before the article will then move to the Senate. Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell has so far been silent on its prospects in his chamber, but he has indicated he believes impeaching Trump will make it easier to rid the Republican Party of his influence. The House also voted last night to approve a resolution calling for Trump to be removed from office through the 25th Amendment, but Vice President Mike Pence, whose power is needed for the move, has made it clear he will not invoke it. Well, officials have opened more than 170 subject files and charged over 70 cases in their expansive investigation into the Capitol riot. The acting U.S. attorney in Washington said the crimes could include charges of sedition and conspiracy, serious crimes that could result in up to 20 years in prison. Other officials described rioters engaging in open-handed combat with police officers and confirmed there were pipe bombs planted outside Republican and Democratic headquarters. New threats of terrorism are also rolling in ahead of Joe Biden's inauguration, including a plot described by a member of Congress in which thousands of armed extremists would surround the Capitol and prevent Democrats from entering. Meanwhile, YouTube is the latest social media giant to take action against President Donald Trump. Last night, the company barred Trump's account from uploading new videos to its channel. YouTube is citing violations of its policies and, quote, concerns about the ongoing potential for violence as reasons for the suspension. YouTube also says it issued a strike against Trump's channel and said comments would be disabled indefinitely. The suspension is expected to last at least seven days. The answer? This Green Bay Packers quarterback will ask some tough questions after leading his team to play off the playoffs again this year. The question, who is Aaron Rodgers? And those tough questions will require answers in the form of a question when Aaron Rodgers is set to serve as guest host for an upcoming episode of Jeopardy. No stranger to the show, the talented QB won the Jeopardy Celebrity Edition back in 2015. Rodgers says Alex Trebek was one of his heroes growing up. Well, that's it for today, guys. For any more information on any of the stories I talked about today, plus a look at your forecast, head on over to our website at MyTwinTears.com or the 18 News app. Stay safe and have a great day. Bye.